it's been a while since I've done an update on this truck. Still a little filthy from when we were at the Duncan show. Take the tanks off and repolish them. I didn't wax a lot of this stuff, so it's oxidized. Stuff that's waxed is fine. Stuff that wasn't waxed, not so much. Anyway, I ended up putting a water tank on it, as most everybody's seen. And, uh, yeah, anyway, I, ended, I had to do some mods. The first pump I used didn't make very much pressure, so it wasn't so good. It was more of a volume pump and no pressure, so yesterday I picked up a, a windshield washer pump from Princess Auto. Tried it out. It was the same sort of thing, actually. It had a, It has a pressure relief valve in it and a uh, really soft spring so as soon as any pressure was built up at all pretty much it started to just go back through itself there or whatever the way the relief valve set up it just recycles through the pump so a little jerry rig in there and a couple of really stiff springs so it basically doesn't have any relief valve at all anymore um, now it makes some good pressure definitely works a little better doing this so I'll see if I can set this up Coming out of there like a good thing now. Lots of loose gravel on the road right here from when I tested Benny's trailer the other day. That really comes way well out of there. If I could drill the holes straighter in the damn discharge pipes, it'd be good, but. not messing around now. It holds about six liters of water. I don't think it'll take very long to pump it all out at this rate. Truck's not engaging in the first gear properly. Gotta figure out what's going on there. This is driving me nuts. Hard enough to go slow with it. I think I may take the standard three speed out of it, even though it's been modified to have a reduction ahead of the transmission. It's still too fast. It's hard to go slow enough when you're doing this. I need a roller. Pretty good though. It doesn't take long to pack the road down. I need more controllers. Pump's hard enough now that you can actually hear it sucking air through the, the vent. It's almost might need a bigger vent actually. That doesn't seem to make any difference though when you pull the cap off it still does the same thing so same amount of water comes out of it I should say you don't hear the sucking noise anyway I hope to make these servo operated so that they go up and down stuff like that still got the 
Shutters open and close. Hopefully get a sound unit for this thing one day. Make some different wheels for it, I think. It's more classic looking stuff. Anyhow, it's a bit of an update. And, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching.